Welcome to our channel, where we bring you the latest and greatest in home entertainment technology. In today's video, we'll be discussing the best Danone AV receivers for 2023. Danone is a well-respected name in the audio industry, and their AV receivers are no exception. We've done the research and testing to bring you the top models based on factors like sound quality, connectivity, and ease of use. So, sit back and relax as we dive into the best of the best and help you choose the perfect Danone AV receiver for your needs. At number one is the Danone AVR X6700H. I'm occasionally astounded by how much entertainment a top-notch surround sound system offers. Play video games, listen to music, or view movies and TV shows simultaneously in several rooms. You may enjoy each of these endeavors to the fullest with the aid of Danone's AVR X6700H. The 11 channels on this receiver can simultaneously power your Dolby Atmos home theater and stereo speakers in two other rooms. 2020 adds features including Bluetooth transmission to headphones, 8K video upscaling, and improved audio return channel, which enables you to send full resolution surround sound signals from your TV to your receiver. The AVRX 6700H features 13 speaker outputs and can power up to 11 speakers simultaneously. You can select from a variety of home theater and wired multi-room music systems as a result. Utilize every one of the 11 channels in a 7.2, 4, or 9.2, 2 Dolby Atmos or DTS X system or opt for a more basic surround sound setup and use the extra channels for music in a different room. If you're anything like me, in addition to viewing movies, you'll also use your new receiver to play music. You can stream music from your phone or tablet to the AVR X6700H via Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and even Apple AirPlay 2. If you're using Rune, it will also appear on your player list, like playing vinyl. For your turntable, this receiver offers a built-in phono input. Also, you may play high-resolution tunes from a USB drive or network PC if you've painstakingly created a great music library. HEOS you may use the AVR X6700H to access all of your music, including tracks from your personal library, internet radio, and well-known streaming services like Pandora. Spotify, and Tidal. It is very simple to incorporate this receiver into a wireless multi-room audio setup. Use the free EOS app to independently manage the sound in each room while streaming music to EOS wireless speakers and other components in separate spaces. You may choose which rooms you want to use, explore audio sources, and control playback with the app. Enjoy the same music throughout your house or switch it up in each space. You can provide voice instructions to the AVR X6700H using your Echo devices by using the HEOS Home Entertainment skill for Amazon Alexa. The receiver and other HEOS enabled devices allow for simple input switching as well as volume and playback control. Moreover, Alexa can assist you with music searches and content streaming to several rooms using your multi-room HEOS system. Furthermore, compatible with gadgets that support Google Assistant is the AVR X6700H. You may ask your Google Home or Google Pixel phone to alter the volume, play, pause, skip songs, and more after opening a song in the HEOS app. At number 2 is Denon AVR X4800H. What distinguishes Denon as a well-known and dependable AV receiver producer? In order to provide the finest user experience and guarantee complete customer satisfaction, the non-home theater receivers combine elegant design, good connectivity, excellent video performance, and superb sound quality. What do you think of the brand new Denon AVR X4800H model? Does it have greater power than the Denon AVR X4700H it replaced? What unique capabilities does this model provide consumers in terms of connectivity, audio quality, and video output. In terms of design, Denon didn't make any significant adjustments between the X4800H and the X4700H. The entire layout appears appealing. These days, AV receivers come in more traditional designs, but this black box is a flip-down door and a properly proportioned display. There are two sizable knobs and a little power button on the front panel. There are numerous controls, including jacks, source selection keys, zone selection keys, and USB and HDMI inputs when you open the flip-down door. In order to ensure smooth functioning without having to worry about overheating, Denon has incorporated adequate ventilation on top. 
This particular model includes a reliable remote control with straightforward buttons in order to provide users with a solid, stable, and well-built home theater receiver. The manufacturer follows the conventional design process. There is no need to be concerned about the model's construction. It is a sturdy, classically styled receiver with a good-looking appearance. Even though this model lacks creativity, you won't ever be dissatisfied with the design or manufacturing quality. There are four subwoofer outputs on this AV receiver. The Denon AVRX4800H is a very effective receiver with exceptional audio optimization capabilities and flexibility thanks to these enhanced subwoofer outputs. These several powered sub-outputs enable the X4800H to deliver unrivaled bass with a clear focus on balance. You may anticipate an even distribution of bass across your environment. In other words, you may precisely calibrate the speaker system using the Odyssey measurement microphone. To create the ideal listening experience, it can be done precisely in accordance with the special layout of your room. In other words, the Odyssey Speaker Calibration Suite adjusts the sound in your theater based on the particular needs of your room. Direct Live Calibration is also compatible with the X4800H. You can use the Advanced Speaker Calibration Program for Direct Live with the aid of an upcoming firmware upgrade. With the help of this tool, you can fine-tune your system output so that it precisely complements the unique sound qualities of your environment. Overall, this AV receiver raises the bar for surround sound. Internet music can be wirelessly streamed with simplicity. Owing to the EOS technology that is incorporated in, any source can be used to stream music, including internet radio, your personal library, and popular streaming services like Tidal, Spotify, and Pandora. It is simple to incorporate this home theater receiver into a wireless multi-room configuration. The HEOS app enables you to stream music in various rooms while precisely adjusting the sound in each space separately. Also, each area, you can have an unmatched gaming experience by connecting this device to a video game system. Because of characteristics like ELM, QFT, and VRR, to provide the finest playing experience, these cutting-edge technologies will alter the refresh rate, reduce the latency, and activate the TV mode game. More than a billion calculations are performed every second by this home theater AV receiver. Due to the most cutting-edge DSP chip, the Denon AVR-X4800H model lets you experience dramatic audio and video along with strong music. The level of audio resolution is raised by features like L32 processing and high-resolution audio. This model's HDMI connections can support cutting-edge technology like Dolby Vision, the newest HDR standards, including 10+, are supported by this AV receiver, along with HLG. The X4800H transforms your watching experience with its 4K or 8K Ultra HD capabilities and great color video performance and contrast. Voice assistants like Google Assistant, Amazon Alexa, Josh AI, and Apple Siri all function flawlessly with the X4800H. You can operate the key features with your voice. Oro 3D, a max enhanced, eARC, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity, and HDCP 2.3 support are some of the model's additional noteworthy features. We can refer to this receiver as a 9.4 channel home theater receiver. It does, however, have 11 speaker outputs. Nine things can be powered at once. The amplifier has a power output of 125 watts at 8 ohms and 165 watts at 6 ohms. You can set up a 5.1, 4, or 7.12 DTS, X, or Dolby Atmos system if you use all nine channels. A more immersive listening environment can be produced by using external amplifiers. Even a 5.4, 4 system is possible with the use of external amplifiers. Do not be concerned if you lack height speakers. This gadget uses Dolby Atmos height virtualization to imitate overhead effects. Compared to other models in the same price range, the AVRX4800H offers a wider sound with more details and clarity. Sounds precision and transparency merit special praise. Unmatched dynamics and auditory immersion are available to you. Consistent bass distribution keeps listeners interested. This model makes music sweeter and more captivating by achieving the ideal balance of clarity and spaciousness. Dialogues are recreated by the X4800H without undesirable sibilance. Users of this home theater receiver enjoy the greatest sound at high, low, and mid-range listening volumes. It accurately reproduces even faint noises. Also, you can fully engage in minor ambient effects. 
you shouldn't be concerned about dialogue crossing over with other negative effects. Excellent punch and authority are delivered by the front soundstage. Overall, this model soundstage extension is quite impressive. Even when listening to music and movie soundtracks, it remains flawlessly broad. The sound reverberation is enhanced by the modest facing effect. This model expertly manages the sound to guarantee complete involvement and pleasure. The ultra-fine extension behind you and to the sides provided by the surround channels gives the scene the appropriate grandeur. When it comes to handling various music genres, this adaptable device is among the top choices. It can switch between being delicate or aggressive as needed. The AVRX 4800H is the AV receiver you need if you want to enjoy viewing movies and listening to music in a way that is very engaging. Is the Denon AVRX 4800H a newer model of the AVRX 4700H? The sound produced by this model is wider, more detailed, and has better details. Compared to its forerunner, the sound transparency and precision are higher. AVRX 4800H has enhanced audio and multi-channel surround features even though AVRX 4700H is one of the top receivers under $1,500. Let's contrast Marant Cinema 50 and Denon AVRX 4800H. These two versions are highly regarded by AV receiver enthusiasts. The former, however, performs better in terms of video performance, audio features, and amplifier power. Let's now reach a conclusion. Do the features and performance of the Denon AVRX 4800H surpass those of its predecessors? This 9.4 channel home theater receiver delivers 3D audio and HD video up to 8K and outputs 125 watt per channel. In order to produce great theater quality sound for large rooms, it is also outfitted with four subwoofers, nine channels of amplification, direct live upgradability, and superb connectivity features. Generally, this model provides the best value for the money and meets user requirements for performance and sound quality. At number 3 is Denon AVR-X 3800H. This AV receiver has 11.4 processing channels with a total of 105 watts per channel and 9.4 built-in amplification channels. Together with the standard virtual and up-mixing technologies like Dolby Surround, DTS Neural X, Dolby Atmos Height Virtualization, and DTS Virtual X, it supports a wide range of audio formats and technologies, including Dolby Atmos, DTS X, a Max Enhanced Oro 3D, 360 Reality Audio, and MPEG H Audio. Additionally, Odyssey Malt EQX T32 is included, along with future updates that will add support for Durac Live, four independent subwoofer outputs, high resolution audio, EOS technology, AirPlay 2, voice control, custom integration, MyAmp capabilities, multi room zones, Bluetooth audio transmission, advanced pre amplifier mode. 6 full 40 Gbps HDMI 2.1 ports, and HDMI upscaling. It is challenging to include everything in a single paragraph because there are so many features, audio formats, and technologies that are already available and recently added. With the X3800H, Denon appears to have truly outdone themselves in terms of the number of functions they were able to pack into the device. The X3800H certainly appears excellent on paper. So let's examine everything and see if their latest model is really as good as it seems. The aesthetics and style of both the main unit and the included remote are the same in the X3800H despite the addition of many new features. And to be honest, we find this a little odd given that Marantz, a sister company, underwent a significant design makeover this year. It remains to be seen if this is an indication of what Denon products will look like in the future. The X3800H appears to share the same dimensions as the X3700H, making this a medium-sized AV receiver measuring 17.1 by 15.3 by 9.3. However, as always, you can lower the height to just 6.6 by turning the antennas horizontally, which has no appreciable impact on the AV receiver's signal quality. It weighs the same, 27.6 pounds, which is typical for a product of its size and category. Being a Denon receiver won't win at any design awards in terms of how it actually appears. This traditional black box receiver has straight lines and sharp corners yet sounds far better than it appears to. Like with the majority of Denon receivers, the front has a brushed metal appearance and the same layout as in recent years, with two large circular knobs for source selection on the left and two large circular knobs for volume on the right, 
The front display is prominently positioned in the top center of the front face. A narrow line under the center display houses 10 function buttons, including tuner, end zone 2 controls, dimmer, status, and 4 rapid selection buttons. The power button is located beneath the source selection knob and has a tiny LED light above it. Nothing has changed at all. The audio formats the receiver supports will be the subject of our next examination, where we discover a few noteworthy upgrades. The receiver supports the basic Dolby Atmos and DTS X object oriented audio tracks initially, but in addition to these, it also supports up mixing and virtual technology capabilities to meet all requirements and accommodate different room setups. There are the standard DTS Neural X and Dolby surround up mixing technologies available in order to utilize all of the speakers in your setup. These up-mixing technicians up-convert stereo and vintage mixes. In terms of virtual technology, Dolby Atmos Hide Virtualization and DTS Virtual X may produce sounds that come from virtual speakers that are placed around your room even when there aren't any actual speakers there. The quality and accuracy of this virtual technology are obviously inferior to actual physical speakers, and they are also quite space-dependent. Also, the sound is frequently audibly overprocessed, which is something we have never really liked. We also receive a Max Improved support, which was initially seen in the X3700H, but the X3800H receives even more features. Secondly, Denon made the decision to include Oro 3D, which was previously only available for higher-end receivers until last year. Then there is Sony's 360 Reality Audio which is supported by the receiver when a 360 reality audio streaming device is connected through HDMI. The MPEG-H codec, which has begun to be widely utilized for broadcasting, is also supported. It is already in use in South Korea with ITSC 3.0 and over DVB in some European nations, and it powers the 360 reality audio music on numerous streaming sites. Hence, the X3800H is predicted to remain relevant in this regard, as the MPEG-H format gains popularity during the ensuing years. Each of the nine built-in amplification channels on the X3800H can produce 105 watts of power. Remember that this is only for two channels driven. Therefore, when all nine channels are in use, the number decreases significantly. You also have the option of using 11 channels, However, doing so requires an extra amp to power the final two channels. Nothing has changed. What has actually changed is that the X3800H can now separately drive four subwoofers as opposed to the two that could previously be done. Home theater enthusiasts frequently use multiple subwoofer systems, and it appears that Sound United noticed this. As a result, the existence of four outputs gives you a great deal of flexibility when designing your system. For optimum immersion, you can use four dedicated overhead speakers and a 5.4, four-channel audio system with the built-in amplifiers. In contrast, for our test, we used a 5.14 arrangement that consisted of a single subwoofer and four height speakers positioned at the front and back of our viewing area. The X3800H more than made up for the X2800H modest lackluster performance. When you look at the X3700H feature list, you might not think Denon could improve upon an already excellent product any further. The new AVR X3800H includes all the features of the X3700H in addition to Oro 3D, 360 Reality Audio, and Pegage Audio Support, Direct Live with the 2023 update, 6 HDMI 2.1 ports with full 40 Gbps bandwidth, support for 4 independent subwoofers, an updated user interface with 1000 ADIP resolution, an updated pre-amplifier mode to support specific channel usage, and a minor Wi-Fi module update. Regarding its drawbacks, they are generally insignificant in light of the value that this item does provide. Some customers might not be happy to hear that Denon removed all composite and component ports. Moreover, the front HDMI port is still a missing feature, and the Odyssey Malt EQ Editor program is not free, which is unsatisfactory in our opinion. It would be wonderful to see the main units and the remotes designs updated because they have aged over the years and are now more expensive than the X3700H at retail. The Denon AVR X3800H unquestionably represents a significant improvement over past yearly launches. As with any audio equipment, it could not be flawless. Yet, Denon made sure to add so much value to it that not even the higher retail price could be considered a letdown. 
This is a significant piece of gear that can unquestionably elevate your home theater experience. At number 4 is the non-AVR S760H. The receiver comes with the basic version of Odyssey called Odyssey Molt EQ Auto Calibration System and comes with plenty of extras like high-resolution audio. It supports Dolby Atmos and DTS-X along with the usual virtual and up mixing technology like Dolby Surround, DTS Neural X, Dolby Atmos Height Virtualization, and DTS Virtual X. The three HDMI 2.1 connections with a 40 Gbps bandwidth seem to be the AVR strongest S760H selling point, making the current model the best low-cost gaming option available. The S760H is not designed for large home theaters due to its restricted power output, but it seems to be a great option for smaller gaming or leisure spaces. The main difference between the AVR S760H and earlier models other than the absence of the front HDMI port that has recently seemed to be the norm, is the outside design. The receiver offers up mixing and virtual technology features in addition to the standard Dolby Atmos and DTS-X object-oriented audio tracks, covering all requirements and unique room setups. There are the standard DTS Neural X and Dolby surround up mixing technologies available in order to utilize all of the speakers in your setup. These outmixing technicians up convert stereo and vintage mixes. About virtual technology, the DTS Virtual X is capable of producing sounds that come from speakers that are physically absent around your room. The quality and accuracy of this virtual technology are obviously inferior to actual physical speakers and are highly space dependent. Also, the sound is frequently audibly overprocessed, which is something we have never really liked. If there is anything missing from this list, it would be Oro 3D and Emacs Enhanced since both of these are reserved primarily for the X-Series upper grade releases. The AVR S760H is an entry-level S-Series device with 7 built-in amplification channels, each of which can output 75 watts of power. This figure should not fool you. Manufacturers always issue ratings with only two channels striving. Thus, when all seven channels are in use, the number decreases significantly. A highly intriguing AV receiver is the AVR S760H. Although it is a low-cost option, the number of functions it offers is quite astounding. Performance-wise, the 7.2 channels AV receiver performs as well as you would expect. Its feature set is entirely complete, and one of its strongest qualities is undoubtedly networking. This receiver is a great option for both more sophisticated gaming rooms and small entertainment areas because it is three fully functional, 40 Gbps capable HDMI 2.1 ports. When you consider what you get for your money, there aren't any significant drawbacks to speak about. One is undoubtedly the front HDMI port's absence, and we'd also want to see a simpler remote to go with a better user interface. Finally, because this receiver is not the strongest, it could struggle in larger rooms. Overall, the Denon AVR S760H is a great AV receiver that is perfect for anyone seeking for a cheap model that can be used for a gaming system or a small home theater without worrying about the HDMI 2.1 issues of the past. We suggest Denon highly since it appears to have met expectations. At number 5 is Denon AVR S570BT. You may enjoy movies, video games, and high-res music with the latest technology thanks to Denon's AVR S5 170BT. All four HDMI inputs can handle smooth 8K at 60HC or 4K at 120HC video content, making them ideal for high-end sources like an Apple TV 4K or a 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray player. Even your next-generation gaming console is supported by this receiver, which offers lag-free performance thanks to cutting-edge features like variable refresh rate, fast frame transfer, and auto-low latency mode. In your entertainment area, a 5-channel amplifier produces powerful surround sound. It has a 70-watt rating per channel, which is sufficient power for a surround sound system of average size. To adjust your speaker settings for your particular room, use the receiver's built-in auto calibration feature. Enjoy music coming from Bluetooth devices, such as your tablet or phone. Play the high-resolution music you have on your USB stick collection. Choose your preferred FM or AEM station. Instead, Join a CD player to the RCA, optical, or coaxial inputs of the receiver. Connect a turntable with a built-in phono preamp, or connect a turntable using a separate phono preamp for vintage analog sound 